Hello, my dear friends and learners. Welcome to 504 Absolutely Essential Words. Are you bored of learning new vocabulary words that you forget immediately? You know, the problem is that many of you guys know many words and vocabulary, but you still can't use them in your speaking or writing, right? Don't worry, we have found the right techniques and methods here, finally. This is one of the biggest vocabulary courses of all time. We have spent almost one year preparing this great course for you. This course includes 42 great comprehensive lessons. You'll get more than 14 hours teaching lessons, hundreds of words, examples, clips, pictures, and, and many other things. There is a picture for each word and many different clear examples. The good thing is that the words are repeated over and over and over in different lessons. You will see how these words are used in different movies, clips, and documentaries. And there is a nice story and passage for each lesson. So, in this course, you will improve your reading, pronunciation, speaking, listening as well. And we have added many quizzes and speaking and listening tests that you can check yourself regularly. You can also download the PDF which includes all the content. You can always write down your own example, send it to me and you can have my correction. We believe following these stages will definitely help you to remember these words for a really long time. Plus, if you want to get a higher score on IELTS, TOEFL, GRE, and many other exams, this course is a must. By the way, you know why did I call this course absolutely essential words? Because you will find that such words as squander, rehabilitate, blunder, obesity, and 500 more will turn up in your newspapers, in the magazines you read, in books, on television, in the movies, and in the conversations of the people you meet daily. I am Ahmad Rabi. I've been teaching English students from all around the world more than eight years. I hold MA in Linguistic and TESOL certificate from Cambridge University. I enjoy and love teaching, and I believe that teaching is an art, like an artist. You need to be creative to be a good teacher.